Houston, Doug Fister has come quite a long way. From signing a minor league contract with the Angels, to being designated by assignment for that team, to being bumped out of the Red Sox rotation before finally finding his way back in. And now, Fister finds himself as the Game 3 starter for the Sox in the American League Division Series. Fister, seemingly cemented his spot with a solid performance against the Astros at Fenway Park last Friday, allowing three runs over five and one-third innings. Also not hurting his cause was a stellar postseason history, having totaled a 1.78 era in eight starts in the playoffs. To me, the later action to the staff said Red Sox manager John Farrell, when talking about why he went with Fister instead of Rick Porcello. A little bit more consistent sink, a little bit more separation between sinker and curveball, that's probably what it came down to in addition to some performance and recognizing that guys have pitched well in certain spots, and there's been some challenges mixed in for both. Felt like that was the way to go. The plan will be to have Porcello available for long duty out of the bullpen in the first two games, with the game four starter still to be determined. Farrell said the decision involving Sunday's starting pitcher has a definite thought to it, but he wasn't ready to commit to a pitcher after Fister. There is a chance the Red Sox could bring back Chris Sale on short rest, but that would be partly dependent on what transpires in game one. Eduardo Rodriguez is also an option although for now he is the second lefty out of the bullpen after David Price. Another lineup move Farrell announced was the fact Hanley Ramirez, who is not starting Game 1, will be starting at first base in Game 2. It hasn't been determined where that will but Nunez, with both third base and designated hitter as options. Both Rafael Devers and Devin Marrero are options to play third if Nunez does DH.